I want to share with you something that I was thinking about a lot the past few days. And this thing that I was thinking about is this fine line between the two powers, the powers of working really hard and the powers of letting go. Now, so many times in our lives when we're wanting to work on something or we're wanting to accomplish a goal, we feel this urgency, this rush, this pressure to press on the gas pedal, to work harder, to think more creatively, to try to pivot. And sometimes we need that energy, but there's also this magic that happens when we also know how to let go. You can't press on the gas pedal the whole time. Sometimes you need that, you know, that um, the acceleration to kind of let you keep going and allow kind of the driving to happen. And so there's this place between of like um, putting the pressure and then letting go. And it made me think about kind of in some places in our lives or in some spaces in our lives, and I think specifically in terms of psychotherapy or People who are in this place of wanting to make a change, change in their relationships, change in their symptoms, change in their life situations, because sometimes all of us as humans, we get stuck between the place of activity to the place of letting go. And I know that um, sometimes when something isn't working in the way that you want it to, or at the pace that you want it to, I would get curious if you could think about, are you pressing too hard on the gas pedal or are you being a little bit too passive and letting go? And sometimes what's happening is that either we're pressing too hard on the gas pedal and we're not letting go and just allowing shifts to happen. So many times in psychotherapy or in relationships or in life, you know, we start making a shift or we're making a conscious effort or we're becoming aware or we're engaging in some kind of phase in our lives and we're kind of like waiting for the pot to boil and it's like, give it a minute. Stop pressing so hard. Keep doing what you're doing, okay? And then on the other hand, sometimes people are letting go too much. They're not putting in effort. They're not focused. They're not investing or they're not taking accountability. And then they're wondering why there isn't a change. And so I really believe that there's this fine space between do you need to be pressing a little bit on the gas pedal or do you need to be letting go? And if there is something in your life that's kind of going at a different time frame than what you're imagining, is are you walking that line between putting in effort and letting go? And if you're not, what would be helpful for you to lean more towards? Would it be more helpful to lean towards the letting go and allowing time and space and the process to unfold? Or would it be helpful for you to put a little bit more energy and investment in that? So that's my little tidbit. I'm curious for you what you think. What happens to you? When you actually allow yourself either to let go and allow yourself to appreciate the work that you've put in and continue to put in, and also when you take accountability um, for not putting in actions or not really being aligned with what you say that you're doing, and what are you actually really doing, and how are you really being, and how long has it been? So I get curious about that for you, and I um, I'm hopeful that when you look at that space between the space of doing and being, the space of doing and letting go, that you find some space where you can actually settle and see how things are slowly shifting or will continue to shift as you lean towards um, either more activity or more stillness.